Radio silence. That's been the reality for one radio station for the past two months. A fire burned up a transmitter for Cool 103.9 in Whiteville. I caught up with the DJ and owner of the station to learn how they're trying to rebuild. We are Cool 103.9 FM. Glasgow Hicks is known by his listeners as the Glass Man. He's run Cool 103.9 out of Whiteville since 2019. We just like to have fun. We play good music. People like the music. When I'm on the air, I'm giving out weather, I'm giving out news, I'm giving to my community. But two months ago, his world changed with one phone call. It might have been about 9.30 and my phone rings. And I'm like, okay, hello. <laughs> Transmitter's on fire. My FM transmitter completely gobbled up in flames, completely wasted. Investigators say the fire at the building that housed his transmitters was caused by an electrical problem. It just, you know, it was just random, random act of God, or whatever you want to call it. It just, something happened. Maybe there was a power surge. Who knows? I mean, I've been a broadcaster all my life. I put my heart and soul in this place. And to see that, it was sad. But only his FM transmitter was destroyed. For that, he's grateful. I'll be honest with you, the AM transmitter been burned up, we wouldn't be sitting here. That, that door would be locked and it, we'd, be, we'd be done. Since the fire, he's been streaming online. See, I've got um, 17 people listening right now. It's nice to know they're out there. But he's itching to get back on the air. It's one thing to be streaming on the internet. It's a totally different animal to actually be broadcasting. Hicks says he spent $20,000 on rebuilding since the fire. With the new transmitter, he's hoping to be back sooner rather than later. And I can promise you this, we are going to come back bigger and better, and we're going to make you proud. Hicks tells me he's hoping to get the station back on the air the weekend of June 10th. That will be almost three months since the fire happened.